Hey guys. Another battle in my Venerable L Tractor. So, basically, this is a pure tier 1 battle. Eh, nothing special. But, I mean, we'll probably be going over some uh, tank tactics in, with this um, map, definitely. Um, of course, mines. My general mindset right now is, and eh, let's push this direction. But um, actually, I tend to like to go this direction, and um, you know, we can use this uh, replay to go over a couple of things that are really interesting from a tactical point of view, and using hardcover. Um, I believe is demonstrated in this we play quite well so in some team play so I'm moving forward towards uh, hill um, thinking that hey I'm gonna get a couple of kills do a lot of damage you know but right here I see the the message hey let's basically team up and let's work t work together so I end I figure out that it was this guy and so I say, heh, heck, why not? And so, basically, the default button is um, Z or Z. Um, so, right here, um, what he's done is he's decided to go out and uh, shoot random guys. Um, he's been doing it a while because he's he's been flagged by the um the anti team killing system or anti team damage luckily he hasn't done any damage to this ms1 but still you shouldn't be doing it come on guys this is a team game and there's no reason to start shooting up your own teammates um note to you guys some people tend to uh, blow those guys away um, uh, once they turn blue, so really, really, really try and avoid being blue. So, uh, or two shoot. So, uh, 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 how do you do that? Oh, here it is. Um, sorry. So, what's happened here is this Ortusu is coming. And what I've done is I've lined myself up with this indentation in the rock. And the idea is that I'm going to get a shot off, move forward. Because I'm moving, like, this is my forward move, or uh, forward movement. And by moving forward, I'm actually. I'm actually going to move faster moving forward than say reverse and you can see that indicated here in this corner the km dash or slash h or kilometers per hour so I'm lining him up he's under my gun depression but he's gonna pop up whoa he did you see that light bulb just there he just spotted me so I'm moving forward into cover and so because I moved into cover I've broken line of sight and he disappears but I also disappear for him and here indicates his last known position and I can assume that he's going to continue moving forward so I look around just keep an eye on things I'm not too happy about that blue player and I really don't want him shooting me up so I'm just gonna be wary of him. Oh! There he is! I put my first shot into him. He misses. I put a second shot. I put a third shot. And I get him. And I move back into cover. So next I'm gonna just sweep the little tr tri triangle corner of the town just see what's go going on out there uh, 
Um, when I reversed out from behind that rock, I was probably zoomed in and uh, just looking to try and hit him. As soon as I put my vehicle on him. I'm just sitting here just trying to get some view range on them. See what I can see. Okay. <sighs> Penetration. And Penetration. he spotted me but I put two good shots into him. Back Enemy off and destroyed. he didn't back off far enough because I just pushed, put the kill shot into him. So I'm moving forward and I just got hit. So now I'm looking for cover and that house looks awfully solid. So I'm going to stay in behind him. So at this point, what I'm trying to do is, um, I'm trying to get my gun out as far as possible from the wall, which is here, and but expose as little of this tank as possible because the engine's up here, and generally it's a bad thing just to try to or expose your tank completely. So he backs out, I turn another one into him, and I move forward. So his shot was so inaccurate that it hits the wall um, and so it could have come and probably gotten past my back but I just didn't want to risk it so I pull in as far as possible so I re-angle a little bit just trying to position myself and oh my I just got shot in the back so I reposition to try and place myself so that I'm covered from this angle and I'm also covered from this angle so but I'm also not far far enough up that um, they can that either end can shoot me um, in this position I'm probably as positioned as good as possible because Honestly, I need to engage these targets over here, and this one over here, yeah, it's okay. So let's get back to action. So I line them up, and I put two shots in that general location, call for help. Uh, okay, I'm kind of working, working my way into near the building he's he's doing exactly what I'm I was doing um, he is back he's backing up so his turrets like over here and he's trying to work this corner um, looking towards this corridor which is the entrance to the hill Critical hit. I put one shot into him, it's a critical, and he backs off. As he moves forward, basically. So, I'm pretty well stuck here. So that MS1 comes in to help. And... So I'm going to try and poke out. I take a look around. And he just take, he just took a shot in the engine. The MS1, that is. Fresh meat, fresh meat. So that was the target who was shooting me from the island at first. So now he's he's lit, and I'm shooting him. So if you notice, before I got um, the outline on him, I was searching around a little bit, just trying to find the outline because the outline means that I have my reticle on him, and I can actually make shots. But be aware that um, that outline also goes through ground, so you may have a 
your vehicle on them, but you also have to be aware of the ground because the the vehicle may make it seem like you have a lot more tank than um, you have to work with in terms of a target. And of course, he's at one health, so he's lucky to be alive. So I moved to this cover. And so my mindset at this point is this hill covers me from the brunt of um, the enemies as shown in my mini map here. And so I'm just keeping an eye on um, what targets I do see and generally where they've been coming from. And so um, just keep an eye. Oh, here he comes. And damage one and one health. Paint house. Man, he's a survivor. At this point, um, it's nice to have him alive. So, um, it's. I really think I need him on cap. I really. Either that or I need him in behind one of these buildings protecting himself from it. So, I ask him to get over here. And he goes for a hard cover instead. So, I keep. My gun forward because I'm sure the T1 is coming. And I wait and I wait and he's dead. Because his his gun be is at the back of the tank. So what I was waiting for was his engine deck or his side to show. So he poked out and I just blasted him. And that's Pewo. Um, standard operating procedure for one of those T1s. If you can do it. And I'm just staying here, waiting for the timer to, ti to uh, finish up. And so that's that replay.